Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And today I decided to do a first impression. So today I went to Walmart and I was looking for just normal everyday like makeup removing wipes and stuff like that. And I don't know about you guys, but I love to do like face masks. Um, I have a, what is it? A sea salt. I think it's sea salt or dead sea minerals or something like that one that I use. I also have an avocado and oatmeal mask. And I love both of those. But as I was looking at the makeup removing wipes, I saw another one that seemed kind of interesting. So I have a scrub that gets rid of my blackheads and it has charcoal in it. And then I saw this one. It's by the exact same brand as the avocado and I believe the Dead Sea Mineral one is also the same brand. Um, but it's a charcoal and black sugar polishing mask. Um, my skin has been feeling a little oily as of lately. So I figured, why not try a new mask and do sort of like a first impression. So I'm going to go put this on and I'm going to let it sit for a little bit and then I will get back at you guys later with kind of one, how it feels when I put it on and two, how it feels when I take it off and the difference that I can feel in my skin. So I'm back now, I have the face mask applied and I definitely wasn't expecting it to be this way. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it on there, but basically it's literally what it says it is. It's charcoal and sugar and it was really grainy. <laughs> um, it felt really weird. Um, definitely felt the exfoliation part of it, um, so I'm hoping my skin is going to be soft. After I take this off, um, I'm going to leave it on and take care of like laundry and work on some homework and stuff. I'm going to rinse it off in maybe 10 to 15 minutes. It says 5 to 7, but I don't really think there's much harm in leaving it on for longer. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave this on for a little bit, let it do its purifying magic, and I will get back at you guys later and we will see the finished result, so stay tuned. All right, so I'm back. I have rinsed off the face mask, and I really liked it. Um, it was definitely, it didn't feel like um, a lot of the other masks I've done where it's like the clay sort of thing, and it's all like, I can't find the word to describe how it feels. But, I liked it because it was very lightweight. Um, yeah, you had like the sugar and stuff on your face, um, but it didn't feel weird. It felt pretty nice. Um, it was really easy to remove. Um, I basically just took a towel, put some warm water on it, and wiped it off, and it came off right away. And I really like how my face feels. My face feels really soft. It feels really exfoliated, obviously, because Basically, it exfoliates. Your, like anytime you touch it, when you're taking it off, it kind of it, it still does a little bit of exfoliation. Um, so I really like this. I really recommend this face mask if you're looking for a nice face mask to do. Um, Freeman's face masks are really nice. I get them at Walmart, and I think they're around four bucks. So I would recommend that if you're looking for a face mask, very inexpensive, very easy to use, and it leaves your face feeling nice and clean. So I hope you guys liked this first impression. Um, leave a comment down below if you have anything else you want me to do a first impression of. Um, subscribe down below. I have a lot of different videos that I post. I post vlogs. I post beauty videos like this. Um, I post random things like I've done the boyfriend tag, I've done the bean boozle challenge, I've done all sorts of videos. So go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below and check out my videos. And like the video if you liked it. I hope you guys did like the video. If there's anything you think I can do to improve on my videos, leave a comment down below. If you have any suggestions for future videos, like I said, leave a comment down below. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.
Where are we? 